An Emporia man may be able to walk out of prison free after serving nearly three decades for the murder of a Sussex County police officer. It's a crime he says he did not commit. And the Supreme Court of Virginia has ordered the Virginia Court of Appeals to grant Terrence Richardson, one of the two men accused, a new hearing. 8 News reporter Victoria Lucas joins us live in the Digital Center this morning with more on what that order says. Victoria. Hey, Delaney and Heather, good morning. We've been following this report since 2017. Our 8 News team was able to obtain the order in my hands. Now, the Supreme Court of Virginia is stating, quote, there is reversible error in the judgment of the Court of Appeals. Terrence Richardson and Farone Claiborne became suspects in the case of a Sussex County police officer, Alan Gibson, who was gunned down in the woods behind an apartment complex in Waverly, Virginia on April 25, 1998. We're told Richardson and Claiborne feared the death penalty and took a plea deal on lesser charges in state court. A federal jury also found them not guilty. It was a sentencing for a drug charge that had a judge tack on the murder convictions in the state court that put them behind, behind bars for life. Since then, numerous advocacy groups and nonprofits have called for their innocence. A former Attorney General, Mark Herring, joined a petition back in November of 2021 writing to the state's Court of Appeals to grant Richardson a writ of actual innocence after new evidence was brought to light. Attorney General Jason Miares then sent a letter to the court in February of the next year asking to reverse the state's position on the matter. Richardson's attorney, Jarrett Adams, filed a counter agreement claiming at that stage in the case, Miares could not legally change the Commonwealth's position. A pivotal turn in this matter with the Supreme Court's involvement. We'll be sure to keep you updated as more details are brought forth. Live in the Digital Center, Victoria Lucas, 8 News.